I, I've been looking for a way to describe myself. I'm not a bad person. I've been fighting since I was a child. I'm not a survivor. I'm a warrior. And I identify myself with a lion. I feel like I'm a lion in a way. If I do believe in re reincarnation, and I think I, I was a lion before, because I do have the drive, I do have the, the power, and I have you know, the, the mentality of, uh, of a lion. A warrior with the wings, that means that I'm ready to fly. I'm ready to devour the world. It totally is, you know, the essence of Tony Castillo. My name is Danny McFarland, and I'm a retired decorated deputy sheriff who was nearly killed and permanently disabled in the line of duty. I suffered from excruciating pain every second of every day of my life until I healed my mind and body holistically. My darkest moments in life became my greatest gifts. And now I'm empowering others to do the same by sharing inspirational stories from hurt to happiness. La carretera. Muchas gracias. Oh, not you just lost me now. I came down to Mexico to hear the journey of an ordinary man who overcame extraordinary circumstances to discover his own inner sanctuary. An epic hero's journey of a human being standing in his truth while following his heart's passion. My siblings were really mad at me. They even called me to like, say that I was a loser. I was afraid of they, they couldn't be right. And I ran out of opportunities here in Mexico. It's just the beginning, you know? It was the beginning of the, uh, the most amazing uh, adventure in my life. Chef Tony Castillo is now a proud restaurant owner, U.S. citizen, and was recently awarded the International Chef of the Year. It's a dream. It's a, a dream uh, came true, you know? And now it's happening, so it's real. And Tony told me about his life, his journey, the struggles, and the amazing accomplishments that he's achieved along the way. Gracias, mamá. Gracias por haberme dado la vida. Me hace mucha falta. And they just start shooting. And they shoot three times on my leg. And I just thank you so much for allowing me to be a part of this. Regardless of our perceived differences like race and socioeconomic status, we are all on the same journey of learning to love ourselves and accept ourselves unconditionally. When we look at the depths of who we are, we are so much similar than we are different. Oh yeah, that <laughs> mean it all to me. You know, that sound is okay, we're ready to business. Could you ever imagine 30 years ago that one day you'd be sitting here with a new friend, a cop from California? No. Two new amigos? <laughs> <laughs>